Yo, what's going on guys, Swift Guy here, and welcome back to another video. Today we have a little bit of stuff that I want to cover today. Not really a news channel, but I do like to give my opinion and um, definitely voice my thoughts on some certain topics in the community. And today we have a new one, basically uh, Lego Maestro, the owner of the Hypixel Alert channel, which covers quote-unquote news, and Tenebris, a HCF YouTuber who has um, gone more to commentary style videos as well. Tenny has been poking fun at a lot of Hypixel staff and stuff like that for saying quite, quite stupid things like, um, and in this recent one it got a little bit um, more out of hand than it has recently been. Basically a Hypixel helper had said that aim assist was use at your own risk when uh, somebody asked. Tenny posted uh, a tweet on this which exploded and he posted a video on this which also exploded. Basically Lego Maestro covered this in his quote unquote news but um, it was very clear that uh, he was not intent on covering the actual facts of the story and had a huge bias throughout the entire thing. I'm not going to be using any of LEGO Maester's clips because he'd probably copyright strike it because he doesn't like me very much. So I will just be telling you what he said. If you don't believe me, you can obviously go watch it yourself. But yeah, that's just why I'm not uh, actually providing the source of information for these. So one of LEGO Maestro's first claims in the video is that Tenebris intentionally and has been intentionally baiting um, Hypixel staff uh, to get these said screenshots and um, this one in specific and he said that he was friends with the guy who took the screenshot and they were basically working together to get this um, and trying to bait the helper into saying something that obviously they could use against her but um, if you like even read some of the tweets by Tenny you can clearly tell that he's not friends with the guy nor did he intentionally bait the guy and that he was just simply sent the um, the image and he t retweeted it and he tweeted it out because he found it very comical which anybody would find that very funny that um, a staff member on the largest minecraft network would say something like aim assist is used at your own risk like that's just such a ridiculous thing another claim lego maestro tries to make in his video is that the helper probably made an honest mistake and she accidentally said that it was uh, use at your own risk, but um, I'm not sure about you, but saying aim assist is use at your own risk, like it literally says aim assist, which I mean if you can like put two and two together you can tell that it's assisting you, a, a program is assisting you in your aim, so that, I mean that, that itself should tell you that it's not legit, but you know not everybody can put two and two together, you know, not everybody pass pre-algebra and stuff like that, all those good good fun math classes, and um, yeah, I don't know. So for some reason, Lego Maestro thinks that, that this is like a simple and honest mistake. But I don't know how someone would make a mistake like this. Especially, as I said before, staff on the largest network. On the largest Minecraft network in the world with like a consistent 60,000 players. Obviously, this goes to show that there's definitely a vetting problem that they have when looking for staff members as some of them aren't up to par. I mean, obviously we can go on and on about how the staff aren't up to par, but this is just a little bit too extensive that it, at this point it, it, it's really obvious something is definitely wrong and there needs to be changes. Another point that LEGO Maestro and Hypixel try to make is that it was only one mistake, so um, it, it could have been in, like a one-time thing, but if you're saying aim assist is used at your own risk, I don't think you have um, very much education or skill in terms of cheats, so you probably have made many mistakes like this in the past, giving false information to, to tens if not hundreds of players. So another thing LEGO Maestro intentionally missed covering through his news channel is that Tenebris got mad at Skier for unfollowing him and unretweeting his tweet as they are good friends, and it turns out as Skier said in the DM that he was no longer allowed to be associated with Tenny, which clearly implies that Hypixel probably put a foot in there and said that, you know, we're going to punish people like YouTubers that associate with Tenebris because we don't like him, which is clearly, you know, not something that should be happening. Obviously, Hypixel's free to make his own decisions, but um, I, I just found it kind of curious how LEGO Maestro somehow missed this um, string of tweets. I, know that I didn't have any problem finding it. Like, I just looked at it once and oh there it is that's interesting so this um, point isn't necessarily by uh, by Lego Maestro but Hypixel himself and uh, Lego read this out was that um, 
Hypixel claims that changes have been made, but what I don't understand is from someone believing that aim assist is use, use at your own rate to someone who's educated on cheats and wouldn't make a mistake like this again is definitely going to take longer than about a day or two, uh, which was how long this was tweeted out. And I think there is definitely a deeper issue here than just one helper making a mistake. There obviously is something wrong with their process and something like that, which obviously can't be fixed within one day, and I definitely think it needs to be further looked into. Another point LEGO Maester tries to use in his video is that Tenny is simply using the situation for views and attempting to gain fame off of it, which is quite ironic considering Tenny is getting four times the views and one and a half times the subs per month compared to LEGO Maestro currently, and clearly does not need quote unquote attention from LEGO Maestro to get views. Uh, clearly that's not Tenny what it was after here, he's clearly just showing how bad the Hypixel staff uh, system is right now and that there are clear issues with it which I think is a good thing you know arguably it wasn't the best way of going about it but I definitely think he had a, he was in all rights to do exactly what he did also that's very ironic coming from Lego Maestro and if you've seen any of his titles it's literally just um, all about the popular YouTubers and everything going on there. He doesn't actually cover like anything that's not on the front page of Hypixel forums or on Hypixel's Twitter. He's just constantly trying to see how he can get more views. And he's clearly clickbaiting every single video. So you can tell who's actually needing the views here. And so the final point I'd like to make in this video is that LEGO Maestro clearly did not do any work when making this video. He just wanted to get it out as fast as possible in order to gain as many views as possible, obviously gaining off the drama and stuff like that. Um, you could tell that he clearly didn't view all the tweets, and he only showed the, um, the sides of the story that fit his narrative best, which is Neighbors is a horrible person, and um, that Hypixel was all in the right the entire time. You can also see this when he, A, can't even say to Neighbors' name correctly. If it's literally your main story for the video, I think you should know how to say their name correctly instead of skewering something that should be fairly simple. It's not like too complicated, it's literally tenebrous. Like, I don't know what's difficult about that. And um, at the beginning of the story, he also called Tenebris a well-known Hypixel YouTuber, when Tenebris doesn't even play or upload Hypixel on any consistent basis. He also showed um, Tenebris' quote-unquote skin, which wasn't even his skin. And Tenebris himself said that he doesn't even know what it is, which is quite hilarious. Um, I think this just goes to show how, how much effort Lego Maestro actually puts in his videos. Clearly he gets a lot of information wrong. He doesn't care about the actual facts, he just wants to make certain people look better while making people he doesn't like look worse. Um, and that's exactly the opposite of what a news channel should be. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Leave a like if you enjoyed, leave a dislike if you didn't enjoy, whatever floats your boat. Um, I'd love to know what your thoughts on any of the topics we covered in this video, any questions you have. I know quite a bit about the situation, so if you want to ask anything, I'll see if I can answer it. And um, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.